under there. Hands the other way. Yeah. Again. Yeah. Again. Yeah. You know, these pads can only be an inch and a half. An inch and a half whirls a plenty of, of the foam Heading. thickness. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, but, well, yeah, but two inches you'd squash down to, to half an inch anyway. <laughs> exactly like the blueprint. See that's exactly what we're looking for right there. All we really have to do now is just mock up that seat again and set in there and make sure there's some headroom. No, I think it's perfect. We're sitting in there. We can make this metal now finish around here because the door will cut into the bubble here and it'll taper down until the point where it meets the other side of the door shut. So it'll give us our shape for that. It'll be able to, we'll be able to work out the door swing uh, frame and also where the so where the body finishes, where the door comes into it, and the shape around the top of the bubble. And from the back you'll see also it'll give us the shape not only of that, but also the deck lid and everything else on the back part of the frame and the body. The height of the aluminum piece across the back there is the finishing point yeah, of the Perspex bubble. And oh, then it'll sweep down the sides and it'll just the, marry into where the, the back of the body and the deck lid is. So it's, really you're only going to see a very small part of the bubble from the back, which is good because it'll look more in keeping and more in balance. 